Hey, what's all this, then? I get back off holiday and I find out you've been knocking about with armed robbers. Oh, don't wind me up. I had no idea. Jenny must have been terrified. Is she OK now? Yeah, still pretty shook up, actually. Yeah, I bet she is, being held hostage in her own home. That bloke, you know, I mean, he must have been a complete psycho. Yeah, do they know why he targeted the pub? Yeah, he was trying to stop me telling the police about the robbery. <laughs> well, it, it kind of worked. Just wasn't expecting you to bring the flying squad with him. Risky. Well, I didn't know what to do for the best. Just wanted to make sure Jenny was safe. Hang on, do the police think you're involved with him? No, of course not. Why would they? Well, you're his mate, aren't you? He stayed here for a bit. <laughs> well, hardly mates. I'm seeing if he is. No, but you used to knock about together back in the day. That's that's all I'm saying. Yeah, a bit. Yeah. Did he used to go up to this stuff then? No. He's just a normal lad. Nothing like this at all. No. Right, look, I've got to go and take sight to court, so uh, you carry on grilling Buster Edwards here so you can get some practice in for when them coppers come knocking for your son. Peter! Nick, uh, hang on a sec. Everything OK? Yeah, fine, mate. Yeah, we, we just got back from holiday. I just wanted to check if you were all right. Uh, it's been pretty rough, you know, for everyone. Yeah, I know. Sai told me what happened with Leanne. Thanks for taking him to call. You know, I didn't want him intrude. No, that's no problem. I'm happy to help. But I, I better get on. Look, I, I know that Leanne's angry now, but, you know, she'll, she'll come round eventually. She loves you. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> doesn't feel like that at the moment. Yeah, but we both know what a temper can be like, but, you know, it'll cool down. All I'm saying is don't give up. Love, would you say this is white or colours? White. Yeah, but it's got colours in it, hasn't it? Oh, colours then. No, I'm just saying they might run. Peter, sorry, I, I've got to get through these emails. Oh, you're still here then, mate. Thought the coppers might have dragged you in. Very funny. We'd leave him alone. He's had a rough time. So, uh, how's this sailing holiday go then? Oh, it was amazing, mate. We had a fantastic time, didn't we, love, eh? Yeah. And. It got her away from them flaming emails for five minutes. Yeah, but now I've got a million to go through, haven't I? Ah, I'd love it, me. Did a bit of sailing out in Spain. See any sharks? No, no sharks. Just time to ourselves. Absolute bliss, eh, love? Yes, bliss. We're already uh, thinking about the next one, you know. Well, I am. OK, you know what? I'm, I'm going to nip to the factory because I can't hear myself, thank you. No, hang on. We're supposed to have lunch. Uh, maybe tomorrow. I've got a lot to get through, you know, with nip being off. Right. She okay? Yeah, she's fine. She's just stressed about work as usual. Hey, what would you say? White sort of colours? Mmm. I'll put it in with the other lights. Set it to a 30 wash, though, just to be safe. Ta. You'd be a whiz in that prison laundry room, you. No, no, Miss Chang, the, the delivery is going to be with you very soon. You all right, darling? Oh, yes. I just need to talk to Sarah. Um, no, it's, it's saying this afternoon. All oh, right, then. OK, bye. I need to go meet that client from the tram. You going to be all right here? Yeah, of course I am. Sure, cos I could just take him to the beast, George, do everything there. Prefer... No, bring him in. I am meant to be the manager. I would like to meet him. OK, fine. What do you think you're doing? I was just asking Lena out for lunch. Not that it's any of your business. Oh, well, I'm trying to run a factory, so it is my business. You're not jealous, are you? Oh, don't be ridiculous. I just don't think it's fair on Alina using her to get at me. I'm not trying to get at you. The truth is, I'm moving on and you don't like it. I couldn't give a stuff if you move on or not. I just don't think you should be stood here embarrassing yourself like this. Me? I'm not the one causing the scene. Right, well, I think you better go now or you'll be sorry. <laughs> what are you going to do? Call Gary, ask him to beat me up. Oh, do you know, I am absolutely sick of you. You swan around here like you're God's gift. You're trying to cop off with my stuff. The lazy enough as it is without you winding them up. And I tell you what, you jog on now or I wipe the carpet with you. Who wipes carpet? Oh, my God. You think you're so clever? You know, you're a stupid, smug Scottish git. Sarah. Well, this is Abdullah from Seymour Fashions. He, he wanted to meet you, love. The doctor 